The county lawmaker has pre-filed the bill at the state house with hopes of easing taxes for disabled veterans. House Bill 3115 would provide an income tax credit for disabled vets, giving them a state income tax cut. Emily Johnson is live outside of the Berkeley County Veterans Affairs Office after learning more about this bill. You talked with three veterans today, and what are their thoughts on the bill? Yes, Roth. Well, the veterans I spoke with this morning say that this bill would fill a gap that they see many veterans struggle with when they do not stand at the necessary disability rating that's created by the state. Under current law, veterans receive the tax cut only if they are issued a 100% disability rating by the United States Department of Veteran Affairs. This bill would open the tax credit to all disabilities disabled veterans. State Representative Brandon L. Cox is a primary sponsor of the bill and says it would show the veterans of South Carolina that the state truly cares about them. Berkeley County is a prime example of the need for more veteran benefits as Berkeley County Veterans Affairs Office has veterans waiting for months to schedule appointments for benefits, employment opportunities and resources. There's many veterans that don't rise to that level of disability. They feel lost. This bill would come in and fill that gap. That way they can feel like, you know, the state still appreciates everything that they serve for. As for the current timeline of the bill, Cox says that he's positioned to talk to leadership in the House, hopefully moving the bill forward next week. We will also hear more tonight at 7 o'clock from veterans who will be directly impacted by this bill and how it can help them. Reporting live in Berkeley County, Emily Johnson, Life 5 News.